welcome back to my channel welcome back to another mukbang monday how are you guys today is sunday and i am having a lazy day i woke up with an insane headache i don't wake up with headaches very often or get headaches very often very grateful very grateful please do not jinx this on myself but i am very grateful i don't get headaches but i got a headache this morning i was very quick i popped in them advils and drank a bunch of water and now i am finally feeling myself it took like maybe two hours to finally feel a little bit better and now it is sunday reset so i thought i would come out quickly to grab some lunch with you guys and then i'm gonna head back in and do a little bit of cleaning today i got taco bell if you guys didn't already know i got taco bell i'm super excited i don't think i've done a taco bell mukbang since the last time i had taco bell i don't eat taco bell very often i do have like a few things i really like from the menu like um what is that thing oh the cheesy gordita crunch oh that thing is amazing hold on let me get my little tray I also love their crunch wrap. I also love their quesarito because I really like their rice. But today I got all of the stuff I have never tried from Taco Bell. So I'm very excited. First thing on the menu, we have their berry freeze. I want to make sure that I'm telling you guys the names correctly so that you can get it too. Yes, I got a regular double berry freeze. The reason why I got a regular and hear me out, okay, because I know my best friend's watching this and she told me to get a large because she just actually had taco bell recently and she said just get yourself the large but here's the thing it's my first time trying it i'm a little nervous because what if i can't drink it i also am not a sweet drinker drink drink drinker and on top of that if you go between the hours of two and five you can get it for a dollar so i was like why not you know um so yes i got this so let's try this first because i'm very excited she said it was just amazing and i I, I'm gonna believe her. I always get the, what is that? Mountain Dew Freeze? Mountain Dew, no, Baja Blast. It's by Mountain Dew, but anyways. Mm. Ooh. Mm. Sorry, I had to close this window because I realized it's really loud. The cars are really loud. Maybe I'll just open up this side a little bit more. Yeah, there we go. I think that works out a little bit more. Uh, this, amazing. But I did only get the... Sorry. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I got the red part, which was really good. And then I just got the blue part, which is really good. Mix it together and it's amazing. I understand why my best friend said get a large, but... I still know I'm not going to be able to finish this, so that's okay. Okay, you guys, let's dig into everything I got. The first time I had Taco Bell with you guys, I didn't get the sauces, and you guys ridiculed me. So we got the sauces today. Okay, first thing, it's just because it's at the top, but I'm not going to try it until the end. I got the cinnamon twists. That's what they're called, right? Yeah, cinnamon twists. I've never had these. So I thought, why not? Because I've gotten the Cinnabon Delights. We've got a bunch of the sauces. I just got hot because I remember that's the one that I really liked. I have a few things here. This one is the that thing. This one is the other thing. This one is the burrito, right? Yeah. Okay. So, I'm just trying a bunch of things I have never personally had. One of them will surprise you. And I think I've had it before. I just don't remember it. So, I thought I should get my reaction on camera. Okay, so first things first. I have spicy potato soft taco. I know. <gasps> how have I not had it? And how is it not my favorite? I have no idea. And that is why we're trying it today. To see if it becomes a permanent order menu for me. And then I got a grilled cheese burrito. This is what that is because every time I see a TikTok mukbang pop up and they're eating a Taco Bell burrito, it's that one. And I want to know what it tastes like. And then I got a chalupa. It's my first time getting a chalupa. The only other time I've ever had a chalupa was when Taco Bell came out with a naked chalupa, which 
the chalupa shell was a chicken. Do you guys remember that? And then they just stuffed it with like cheese and lettuce and tomato. And so it was like a taco, but really the chicken was, do you guys know what I'm talking about? I don't know if they've ever brought it back ever since. And I believe that was like back in 2015, somewhere around there. 2015 to 2017, 2014 to 2007, somewhere around there. I don't remember, but anyway, but, but I'm very excited about the Chalupa. I, I specifically got it. I specifically got it with chicken because my best friend, like why? Anyways, um, I specifically got the chicken because my best friend said that I had to get the chicken. So I got it with chicken, no tomato. I'm very excited to try all of this stuff. I also really wanted the chicken empanada, but they were out, of course. So I guess I'm not trying that. Okay, I'm so, so, so excited. I think I'm gonna try the chalupa first because I am, I'm just like, I feel like I know what the spicy potato is gonna taste like. It's a tortilla and the spicy, you know, like, how do you not know what it's going to taste like? But I kind of got nervous when I asked for the chicken empanada and they didn't have it. So I was like, what else do I get? Like, I, I had this all planned out. Like, I wrote it in my notes. I'm, like, reading it off of my notes. So then I was like, mm, I haven't had the potato soft taco. Or at least I don't remember it. So I just randomly grabbed that. But anyways, this is the chalupa. Oh, in all her glory. Look at her. What a beauty. Do you see her? You guys are probably like, yeah, Michelle, we've, we, we know her. We eat her. Ooh, she is saucy. I don't know if I'm going to love her, you guys. I'm going to be honest. And the only reason is because this thing is a freaking, the shell is thickums. really like the show I really like it it has like a little bit of a chewier texture but it's really comparable at least I would compare it to like pita bread but chewier It's good. I'm gonna rate it. Do I rate it by number or do I rate it by will I ever get it again? Um. I'm gonna give it One out of five, I'm going to give it one out of ten, I'm going to give it a six. Yeah, a six. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people like this. I'm just not blown away. I think I like the Gordita Crunch way more. Mmm. Mm. You know why though? They don't really do justice with the meat. They gave me like two pieces of chicken. I think it's sour cream in here. But why is their sour cream so good? Can sour cream taste different? Like... I don't know. I guess I thought growing up sour cream all tasted the same.
Hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't think I'd ever get it again. Not my favorite. But it was delicious. It was like mid. It was like a good solid mid. One of the big reasons why I had it first was because I'm starving. And I knew if I had it when I'm hungry, I could give you my best review. And I'm very comfortable with giving it a six. I'm sorry if it's controversial because I know that everyone loves it. What is it called? Chalupa. I know everyone loves chalupas. Not everyone, but I feel like it's a very popular... Taco from Taco Bell. You know what I'm saying. Okay, let's try this potato taco. Very excited. They call it a spicy potato taco, but I'm thinking it's not because the potatoes are, what is it, spicy, but because there's this sauce in it that looks very like smoked and like chipotle y. Okay. Beautiful. I love potatoes. There is no doubt in my heart that this is not not going to be good. Mmm. It's a potato taco. Can you guys see the inside of that? It's a potato taco. Mmm. It has like a harder spice kick than I thought it was going to have. This sauce is very interesting. I can't tell if I like it. I don't think I like the sauce. Hmm. It's good. It's, um, a potato taco. I also give this a six. I would probably get this if I was high or drunk. For sure. Like, for sure. But not again, Shelper. She is what I've been waiting for. This baby? Mmm. Okay. This is the... Grilled Cheese Burrito. Ah. She's beauty and she's grace. She's Miss United States. How is this? What is this? What? Oh. Uh, ooh. She looks like she's been slugging all night. How do people hold this in their mug pot? I just don't think I can be that girl. So I'm going to use this inner lining. How do you guys eat this? What is happening? How do you? Okay. I'm going to try it. I'm so excited. It smells so good. Mmm. The filling is so good. Do you guys see the inside? Mmm. I know I'm the only one freaking out because I'm sure a lot of you guys have already tried Taco Bell's menus, like all of it. I'm late to the game. I am very aware. When it comes to Taco Bell, I'm very late to the game. Mm. 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 So when I was online looking at like all the items I wanted... I was like, okay, I got to make sure that some of them don't have tomatoes in it because I really don't like tomatoes and it's really going to ruin my meal. So I wanted to make sure that I was going to take it out. And I noticed that there was a bunch of red stuff in this burrito. 
And I was like, what is that? And so I went in and looked for it and it's Fiesta strips, like kind of like Fritos. They look like Fritos. And I really like the texture of it in this burrito. It is so freaking good. This burrito, it's good. I give it a, I think I give this burrito like an eight. It's actually the best one because everything else was cold. And this one is like still warm. I mean, it has to be, but like, I would like all of my food to have some consistency, you know, with the warmth, but that's okay. You know, it's just a drive through, you know, fast food restaurant, but I really like this one. This one's an eight. I would definitely get it again. I'm going to try grabbing it because it's really hard to eat in them. It's just, I have a boo-boo, so it's also not very helpful. Mmm. Wait, this burrito is really good. Mmm. And the rice. Oh my gosh, what the frick? This burrito is everything. I think this is my new new love. The rice just bumped it up to a nine. Because it's so freaking good. Hmm. Wait, you guys. This burrito is so good. What the hell? I didn't think that I would like it this much. And I'm not even putting hot sauce on it. Maybe I should. Maybe I'll do the next bite with the hot sauce packet. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I could do with and without the hot sauce, honestly. This burrito is so good. I'm like, what the hell is wrong with me? I don't think I'm... I don't think I've ever been this obsessed with something like this. I'm like blown away. I want to cry because it's so freaking good. Okay, I'm going to have to make this a last bite because if I bite this, the whole thing's just going to come out because. I don't know whether to cry from sadness that it's all gone or cry from happiness because it was so freaking good. I feel like this burrito embodies all the flavors of Taco Bell. You can pretty much, <laughs> and this isn't a bad thing, but it sounds bad. You can eat this burrito and feel like you have tasted everything on Taco Bell's menu. Do you guys get what I mean when I say that? I feel like you can taste a taco, I mean, you can taste a Crunchwrap Supreme in this. You can taste like a normal taco in this. You can probably taste any of the freaking, uh, even like a Gordita Crunch because I think they use the same sauces. I don't know, it's just really freaking good. Like this thing, I think I might dream about it for the next couple of days. That was beyond delicious, like beyond. Now my order has changed a little bit if I ever go to Taco Bell. It is not, 
I think I just need one gordita crunch and this burrito. Because I used to get the crunch wrap. But the crunch... Throw away the crunch wrap. I would get this berry, berry whatever freeze again as well. Okay, I'm going to try these cinnamon twists. I don't think I'm going to like them. I just got them because I've, I've seen people eat them. And I've never tried it. So I thought I would. Hmm. They're not bad. It tastes like a churro, just like a crispy churro. I would never get it again, but it tastes good. They gave me a lot, too. I mean, I guess this is a normal amount, like, that you should get if you're ordering something. That's honestly it, you guys. I don't have anything else. I ate everything. I loved everything. I especially love the burrito, if you couldn't tell already. you, I, If you couldn't tell... I don't know. I don't know what to tell you because I definitely made love to the damn burrito. It was so freaking good, you guys. I want to relive it again. I have never been this obsessed with anything from Taco Bell, but that was just mind-blowing. Like, mind-freaking-blowing. It was mind-blowing when I just got the meat and the sauce and all of that and the cheese, but then when the rice was added into it, I was like, because <gasps> the rice was kind of smushed to the corner at the end so I couldn't really see it and now that I've had it together it is just a match made and freaking heaven I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for coming along with me to have lunch and try all these things I am now gonna go run errands and then head back home and have a pretty chill day just maybe cleaning up I hope you guys enjoyed this video I love you guys so much make sure to like this video comment down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you guys next time bye